other man holding the mic. Have you seen her? Calling on my friends all around the place. God, LaVert, on my home. Have you seen her? If you figure out, let me know. This is, I know this all looks like fun, uh, but this is really work. And you all dance, what, six hours a day to stay in shape? Cause... Six hours a day, and uh, Thanks. a lot of times we run like four miles a day. Four miles? Yes, and that's prior to the tour. And it is a lot of hard work. Um, I'll, I'll go as far as to say that some people who have come in have ended up leaving because it's a little tough on them. It's, it, they think it's all glitter and everything, but it's some work to go into uh, being able to, you know, dance the whole record. I hear you're pretty strict. Um, as far as what I do, yes, because there's a lot of competition and uh, a lot of elements that come into the entertainment world, uh, whether it be drugs or uh, hustlers and different type of uh, characters come in. I know so you I... don't do drugs, but what if you found out that one of the members of your posse was on drugs? Um, well, the first thing we would do would probably try to help them. We've had people who have come in and we found out that they did um, indulge in drugs. And then our first thing was, well, if you want to be a part of us, you have to quit. And then if they say they can't quit, then we try to get them some help. And if they still don't want to uh, get any help, then, of course, they can't be a part of what we're doing because we don't want any drugs in our Because cause you cannot dance like that and be on drugs. <laughs> no, that's for sure. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Um, we hear that you're really, you have many religious beliefs and that you're friends with the Two Live crew, um, with people from there. And we were wondering if um, you feel it's unethical, the things they sing about. Well, I wouldn't go as far as to say that um, my biggest stance, I'm friends with, with uh, Luther Campbell and the guys who are involved with the Two Live crew. I've known them uh, for a long time before the issue of censorship came up. Um, in, in my belief in God and respecting God, uh, it doesn't mean that because you are an individual and you may not live up to what I think you should, and not, not just Two Live Crew or anybody else, but as an individual, I have to respect you for who you are and what you are regardless. And that actually, that is a part of charity or a part of uh, the love of God, being able to love each person for who they are and what they are. Yeah, I've heard you say that you don't endorse what they say, but... Because we live in America, you respect their right to say it. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah. you say it. Right. Yeah, my name is Veltina. I would like to know, um, who designs your clothes? Uh, it's a gentleman by the name of uh, Duval and uh, James Head. They're from East Oakland, and uh, they're here with me today. Well, we called to ask, you know, what color sets or what should we do with lighting and so forth. One of your people told us that you have 2,000. She said, listen, Hammer has 2,000 outfits, so... We do not know what he will be wearing. So, so do, is it true that you have 2,000 outfits? Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> and, so, and so, do you have a hard time deciding what you're going to wear today? Um, kind of. I mean, I, I just want to be comfortable. It's, it's very important I be comfortable. You know, it's, it's like when you get dressed up to go somewhere. If you don't feel like you're looking your best or comfortable, then everything doesn't seem to be like you want it. Uh -huh. and I can get on the stage sometime and, uh, and, and the outfit he made the sleeve a little short and I look at him I said, man, now how do you expect me to do like this? <laughs> 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 so I'll bring another coat out in between songs or something. 2,000 out. So what kind of closet do you have? Um, a mobile closet. A lot of big cases that we try.